So today's Gotcha Life mini movie is called The Afton Family Meets Williams Family. I'm going to be doing episode one as well as the remake by Shadows Glitch. So I will have the original in the description down below and let me know what other gotcha stories you'd like to see me react to next. <laughs> You're smaller than a roach and I'm proud that you are. You've made a huge mistake. <laughs> I would suggest you run before I dismantle you, baby. I'm not baby right now. In that case, my room is where you're heading. I'm sure Nightmare and Goldie will have fun. Oh, you're not taking me to we are! Huh? Uh, <laughs> Can I help you? Well, my family and I were on a walk and we were going to her car. It seemed to be out of gas and it's getting really late. Do you mind if we stay here for a bit? Give me a sec, I'll call my parents. They're out right now. Hey dad, there's some people here that need a place to stay for a while. And they're wondering if they could stay here. I guess so. Your mother and I are on our way home right now. Okay dad, see ya. You said it's alright. How long are you gonna be staying? That depends on how long we can get our car started again. Okay then, I will show you to the guest bedroom in a second. He sounds a lot like William. But first, do you mind telling me your names? My name is Jessica. Jessica Afton. Julie Afton. Oliver Afton. And I'm Hunter. Uh, why the shocked face? You're telling me your last name is Afton? Yeah. What's wrong with it? I'm Michael Afton. Wait, are you like our cousin or something? My dad has never mentioned anything about having cousins. What's your dad's name? William Afton. <gasps> is she okay? She just fainted because we used to have a brother named William Afton. What does he look like? Brown hair, obsessed with purple. But he ran away when he was really young and I don't know where on earth that mistake. Went. He's obsessed with purple. I think so. You know what? I'll just take you to your room. Is someone going to carry her? Just leave her there. You coming? Okay, okay. So you guys will be staying here. My parents should be home in a second. But for the time being, make yourself comfortable. Do you really think that he's William's son? I don't know. Should we maybe go explore? Sure. So you said there's people here? Yeah, they're in the guest bedroom, but the odd thing is, they said their last name is Afton. That's odd. Uh, uh, William! Uh, Jessica? It is really you! I can't believe it! And he, is he your son? Yes. You had a child and didn't tell us? Actually, I have three kids. Michael's the oldest. Where are the other two? Chris, Liz, and long time no see, Clara. It really has been a long time, hasn't it? <laughs> anyway, these are our other two kids, Elizabeth and Chris. Who are they? My siblings. What? Cool! We have an aunt and uncle! Why does the little one have wings? Uh, me and... Liz, we're playing dress up. <laughs> well, I'm going to start up dinner. Come on. You gotta hide your wings. I know, I will. You're done. Okay, and I think you already know not to tell him that we're already dead. Yes, dead. The food's done. Here you go. And here you go. And you. And you. Yum. Yum. Isn't Michael going to eat? Uh, I'm not hungry. Okay, then. Mom, can I go play with you-know-who? Sure. Hey, eggs. What? What you doing? Nothing, just in the kitchen. Okay, if you're doing nothing, can I come out? We entered, don't you dare! Why? There's other people here, and it's actually Dad's family. So you gotta stay in for now, until I get to my room. This is going to be a lot like we're at school. Oh, okay then, but can I meet them in a controlling way? I guess so, there's nothing wrong with it. Hehehe. <laughs> nerd, what are you doing? I want to meet your family. What are you guys whispering? Um, I just wanted to get to know you guys better, maybe. A nerd? Well, blah, 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 blah. Is there any food? Uh-oh, uh, William. I thought you were dead considering you ran away. Can everyone leave us for a few minutes? I need to talk with him. William, I can help you. No, a nerd. I need to take care of this on my own. Now, everyone, please leave. Your son's eyes just... It's okay. Now, William, it has been a long time. Mind telling me where you've been? No. You shouldn't talk back to your father, young man. Do I look like I'm young? Shut up! Now tell me where you've been! Will it make you happy? Very. Okay, well, I've owned several pizzerias and I've built animatronics for entertainment. That's all you need to know. I don't believe you've made machines that kill innocent children. When I say something, I mean it. Also, nothing in this family is a joke. Sure. Also, that Michael boy is your son? Yes, but if you touch him, you will wish you never stepped foot in this house. 
You're horrible at trying to scare people. Also, do you have any other kids? Yes, I do. Their names are Chris and Elizabeth. Okay, thank you, son. Don't touch them! Or what? Like I said, you will wish you never stepped foot in this house. Just get out of my way. Just keep in mind that you can't kill someone that's already dead, father. Okay, so there are people here, so we gotta lay low. Don't worry, Chris. But if they do something bad to you, are we free to scare them in their sleep? Sure, but as long as they think it's all a bad dream. Anyway, should we get ready to play something tonight? Okay, just stay in the closet. You're playing with toys? Yeah. Well, I think I might go to bed now. It's been a long day. Okay. Okay, get the game ready. Later that night. <gasps> William! My boy is all grown up. And you have a family. Yeah, three kids. I think you met one of them already. Yeah, Michael. But where have you been all these years? I've been worried. Well, I've been around the block, I guess. I'm just happy you're in one piece. Thanks, Mom, but how has Dad been treating you? Fine! Mom, don't lie. By the way, what's under your blindfold? Um, that's personal. William, tell me. I'm sorry, Mom, but I can't. But you don't need to worry. I'm not hurt. Okay, then. Why are you still up? I can't sleep. <laughs> Bye. That seemed a little odd. Were any of you awake last night? No. Well, I woke up and last night the little one came into the kitchen at 2 a.m. Also, William has a blindfold on and won't take it off. Last night, Michael didn't eat. You know, we probably are overthinking this. This is fine. Let's just go eat. So, can we go play in the vents now? Yes, but remember, you need to stay out of sight. And if I fall out, don't try to catch me. Okay. Come on, eggs. <laughs> Was my ship sailing? Maybe. Was he in the vents? Jeez, what a freak. Mike, don't let the past come to your mind. I forgave you a long time ago. I will get my revenge, William. How are you not? Uh, dead? What's going on in here? Dad, should we tell them? I guess so. It is different from school after all. We're already dead. Our whole family is. If that's true, how are you standing right in front of us? Well, let me show you something better. Mike, you're first. I'm telling you my story first. I used to be a night guard at Circus Baby's Pizza World. And on the fifth night, I got all my insides scooped out. So because that happened, I am now a walking corpse with a burnt spaghetti inside of me. Prove it. That's just makeup and an eye contact. In that case, it's reacting time. Glitchy, you know what to do. Is that the burnt spaghetti you were talking about? Y yes. Now it's Elizabeth's turn. Oh my gosh. And guess what? I probably have the worst one. <gasps> my poor baby. Believe us now. Yes. Those clips are edited. Believe us now. Uh, 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 yes. Can I have you two do something? What is it? Can you scare Grandpa? Of course we will. Okay. <laughs> uh, uh, where am I? Ah! What are you? Ask Chris. Uh, uh. <laughs> Chris, something came in my room. Uh. <laughs> Great job, guys. The next day. Son, I just want to let you know that your eyes are still beautiful. Thanks, Mom. And I just don't wear a blindfold because I don't really like the color. It's also because it's not a normal eye color. Still, though. Glitchy Hammer. You still haven't told us who that is. I'm Glitchtrap. He's a virus that lives in my head and another reason why I wear a blindfold. Why is he one of the reasons? Can I do it? Fine, but you know not to do anything bad. Okay, Willie. <laughs> hey, don't worry. The only thing I've done with Will's body is make him cute. But that was years ago. So this was your fault? Yeah. Bye. Don't worry. He made a promise with me. He said not to kill anymore unless we really need to. And your car is all fixed. Thank you, sweetie. This has been such a huge gift to get to see you again. I love you, Will. Love you too, Mom. I don't get why you're looking at a mirror with your blindfold on. Well, I honestly don't have anything better to do with my life. Why can't I have a cookie? I baked them, so they're mine. Ah! <laughs> Can I come out? Fine. 
What's up? Our secrets. Well then, why won't you tell your family? I don't want them to think that I'm crazy to have something living in my mind. Someone's coming. Dad, Chris stole my candy again. Okay, then get it back. But I need help. Ugh. Why, Chris, why? Yummy. I'll get it. There's no way that's William. What are you doing here? Sounds like him to me. Well. Uh, hi, big sis. Come on in. Accept him. Aw, oh, but your dad needs a place to live since our house burnt down. Ugh. Who are you talking to? Huh? Who's this? My daughter. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. Uh, how many kids do you have? Three. Who are these people? My family. <gasps> Ooh. Can you two girls play dress up with me? Sure. Mm -hmm. If you do anything to my kids or wife, I will kill you. Am I supposed to be scared? Oh, you should be of me. If they do anything wrong, can I kill them? Possibly my dad only. Or my mom. And I said possibly, so don't get worked up. Okay. <gasps> there. And can you tell me where the bathroom is? Sure, two left. So, what's your name again? Elizabeth. Can I try on one of your dresses? Okay. <laughs> oh, hey! Why did you do that? You spoiled rotten girl. You don't deserve so many dresses. You know the next time you say that, you will be dead. Like I'm scared of a weak little girl. <laughs> Calm down, Liz. Oh, you're Will's boys, aren't you? Yeah, who are you? I'm your dad's dad. Uh, uh, oh, nice teddy. Can I see him? Hmm, he looks like garbage. Uh, oh my gosh, please don't turn him into Goldie. What's your problem? Put him down. And what are you gonna do? Why are his eyes purple? I thought they were white. Down or I will. Now get away from my kids. I'm going to bed. Michael. Wait. Mike. La la la. What do you want? La la la. Mikey. Michael. Mike. What do you want? Uh, I'm sorry I'm bothering you. Sorry, I didn't mean it like that. Do you need anything? Um, you should eat something. You haven't eaten in like three days. I'm not hungry. Bye. The next morning, 7 a.m. Mike, you need to sleep. But what if I don't wanna? Okay, if you don't sleep, I'm coming out. We entered! You look tired. Well, I'm not going to sleep, so... Shh. Are you sick, eggs? Do you want me to call a doctor? You're annoying me. Isn't it what I do best? Yeah. Stay here. I'm gonna change, and if anyone comes, hide. Got it, eggs? Uh -uh. Michael, are you going to eat breakfast? No. Honey. I'm not hungry. <laughs> <sighs> Let me guess, he threw up again. Yes, I'm just worried. <laughs> Is he a puke, baby? Ugh. Say that to my face, please. Get your hand off me. This mistake thinks he's so strong. You and the rest of your family have three seconds to get out of my house. One, two... Three! Why did you kick them out? I thought they were your family. I'm happy they left. His mom ripped up one of my dresses. Dad always calls me a mistake, and I think it's true. I'm a psychopath. Well, now since they're gone, I'm gonna go cry myself to sleep. I never realized your family was so bad, Will. I'm sorry. I never got to kill them. Well, it was your choice when you were controlling me. <laughs> You're purple again. Think I don't know that? Also, I want some time alone. Okay. Ugh. I'm lucky I have someone to talk to other than my family. What's wrong with them? Because my family doesn't believe in what I think is true most times. The first times I met you, you guys killed me. It wasn't just us that tried to kill you before. I know. Michael's tried. But dad's been overprotective. Are we overprotective? No, not really. But I really like you guys. You know us well. What would my family's reaction be if they were stuck in my room for five nights? Alrighty, so that was the Afton Family Meets Williams Family Episode 1 and the remake by Shadows Glitch. I will have the original in the description down below, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a like, and if you're new, subscribe to become a mermaid or merman. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.